Hello my Android friends, welcome to another episode of The Mandroid Show. I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com and I have to apologize. It's been what, like two weeks uh, since the last show? I'm sorry, I'm truly sorry that you know my voice gets high when I'm that sorry, seriously. Ask every girlfriend I've ever had. No, I had some complications with my uh, computer, <laughs> good old Mac. Apple. I think uh, when I went on that rant on uh, the last show, you know, shooting the Apple logo. Yeah, that. Uh, I think my uh, computer uh, realized that and started destroying my editor a little bit. Basically, this is what happened. So anyways, you know, I had that wedding to do and everything like that, so I had to get it all worked out. But I'm back. I'm back for good. You can dry your tears. I'm here to give you all the goodness and all the Android news that you can take. All that you can fit in your pretty little mouth. So why am I still talking? Let's talk some Android. Now yes, a lot of things have happened since the last show, and I'm not going to go over stuff that happened really last week. I'm going to more go over stuff that happened this week. Starting with the Google Asus Nexus 7 tablet. Oh. Yes, that seems to be the name of the new Google Nexus tablet that is coming out. And the benchmark results came out and they're looking pretty spiffy. And with this benchmark, we did confirm that Asus is developing this 7-inch tablet. As well as running quad-core, I think a Tegra 3 processor is going to be in that bad boy. But the interesting thing is, there was speculation that Jelly Bean might be running on this new tablet. So we're like, alright, Android 5.0, let's do this! On a seven inch tablet though? That's what I was thinking. I was thinking, that's bull. I'm just hitting puberty by the way. That's why I'm squeaking a lot. But then people dug deeper and noticed it was running an OS that was named this right here. I'm not gonna repeat what it says because I forgot to write down the script. And then they're saying it's gonna be running Android 4.1 and that's what Jelly Bean's gonna be. So a little bit of a question mark going on with this tablet. I guess we'll find out later this month at Google I.O. when they unveil this bad boy. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below in the balls area. Did you miss the balls area? It's still there. <laughs> just as sensitive as always. Now even though the new Google Asus Nexus tablet is uh, all the rave right now, we still have Samsung Galaxy S3 Watch 2012. Woohoo! Okay, it's not that kind of excitement. Looks like a couple days ago, the international Samsung Galaxy S3 was released. Of course, we live in the States, so we, uh, <laughs> Get it last. Samsung Galaxy S3. It's powered by letting Americans wait. Made by guys that say, Stop it, Sally, American. What was that? But, anyways, the anticipated phone launched in 28 countries, so my international brothers and sisters who got one. Let me know down below in the comments area and let me know how you like it. Do you snuggle with it? Do you shower with it? Hell, it knows when you're sleeping. It's kind of like Santa Claus. Alright, and speaking of the Samsung Galaxy S3, it looks like leaked dates for the T Mobile version of the Galaxy S3, as well as the Galaxy Note, have been. Well, leaked out. Oh yeah, and the new My Touch also that date too, because everybody is super excited. Well, you know, they try. But anyways, mark June 20th and July 11th on your calendars, my Android friends. Because the Galaxy S3 is supposed to be arriving on June 20th, and the Galaxy Note is supposed to be arriving on July 11th. Oh yeah, and that My Touch phone too. No prices have been announced just yet, but it should run you just under $1.5 billion. So my T-Mobile brothers and sisters, Who's gonna get a Galaxy S3 or a Galaxy Note? And that My Touch phone. Let me know down below if you're gonna get the Galaxy S3 or the Note. I think the only My Touch I'll be doing is. Anyways, all right, for those of you that are still rocking that pure Google awesomeness, the Galaxy Nexus, we have a CM9 add on pack that brings some of that Galaxy S3 to your phone. Yes, I know, why would you want anything touch with? Well, I actually don't know why you want anything touch with. Yeah, honestly. But anyways, this add-on pack does bring on the uh, TouchWiz UX launcher, as well as apps like S Voice. So I know a lot of people really want that Siri kind of feature on their phone. I think people just get lonely. You guys see those commercials with like the celebrities talking their Siri's on their phones, like Sam Jackson and Zoe Deschanel. That's funny because they don't use like the real commercial that Sam Jackson shot. And you will know my name is the Lord when I lay my vengeance upon thee. Dude, that's the Sam Jackson that we know. Live wallpapers and regular wallpapers are also included, so if you feel like getting some Galaxy S3 on your Galaxy Nexus, check down the links below for the article and get some of that shiz on your phone. The Samsung Galaxy Nexus, inspired by the Android community, why the f*** would you want TouchWiz? Well, my HTC brothers and sisters, the HTC Evo 4G LTE and One X is out of US Customs and heading to stores. Yay! 
say in your face, Apple. This was reported a couple days ago that these phones are out of US customs for that ridiculousness that Apple infringed upon them. If you guys remember, it was that little pop-up window that came up in your like message thread when there was a hyperlink. It was reported though that all HTC phones have to go through US customs first before they hit the stores though. As if they're like smuggling drugs in these phones. It's ridiculous. Well now these phones will realize what we have to go through when we want to board a plane. Giggity, giggity, giggity. So anyways, yes, the HTC Evo 4G LTE will be hitting stores tomorrow, June 2nd. So let me know who's gonna get one down below in the comments area. Or if you pre-ordered it, you're probably getting it as we speak or you got it yesterday. Who knows? Let me know down below in the balls area. We're HTC brothers now. We must share like everything and can I borrow like 20 bucks? Well, all right guys, that's all the news I'm gonna talk about. I was gonna kind of keep the news stuff very short. No apps or tweaks or ICS updates you wanna do, just go to androidspin.com, check all that stuff out. It is actually time for that lovely segment and not a hot nerdy girl of the week. Yes, no hot nerdy girl of the week, don't get upset. Got something better for you. Got two things actually better for you guys. It's giveaway time! <laughs> yes, it's giveaway time, guys. And what are we giving away? We are giving away Cruiser Light phone cases. Got mine right here. Nice blue one with Andy on the back. It's so pretty, isn't it cute? Yeah, these cases are really freaking awesome. They just look great. They fit great. It's kind of like a condom. Okay, edit that part out. Anyways, guys, we're gonna be giving 10 of these away for free. And what we ask for you is, we want you to screenshot your main home screen and send it to us. And we will be picking the top 10 best ones in our opinion. And those people will be getting a cruiser light case for their phone. Now there's many ways that you can give it to us. You can either email it to the Mandroid Show at androidspin.com or you can post it to the Mandroid Show's G Plus page, my G Plus page, David Pena, P-E-N-A, my Twitter, Android Spins G Plus page, or Android Spins Twitter. So you got many choices to post your home screen. All the links will be down below. Take a screenshot. Put something creative, you have a cool little widget or cool wallpaper. Again, we'll be choosing 10 to get a free Cruiser Light case. Make sure you uh, put your device, what device you have, so that we can make sure a Cruiser Light makes it for your phone. You get a G1! I don't think they have one for G1s. By the way, upgrade your phone. It's been like four years. So anyways, guys, yes, take a screenshot of your phone and get it to us, and we will see if you get a free Cruiser Light case. So get on it, guys, but not just yet. All right, I finally did something uh, I've been wanting to do for a little while, and I was actually going to do it last week just because I was going to be doing that wedding, and I wasn't going to really do a show. You know, I tried, and I stripped my computer. Anyways, I've been doing this show probably for like the past, what, like seven months or so? I don't know, like that bad with math. But what I wanted to do was put a clip show together. You know, just some of the funny moments throughout all the shows. I mean, I had to go through like 40 plus shows just to pick out the good stuff. So I thought it'd be a good treat for you because, you know, if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have a show. I love you guys, you know, especially the ones that watch every week and enjoy the show. And of course, we got new subscribers too that probably didn't see past shows, so you get to see a little taste of what it started off with. I mean, it basically was just me sitting in a chair talking like really close to your face. Anyways, guys, I just want to say thank you. Uh, us over at Android Spin, I really appreciate you guys visiting the site and watching the shows. So here's a Mandroid clip show, just for you guys. Enjoy the madness. Hello all you Android fans out there. Welcome to the first episode of The Mandroid Show. Ho ho ho, freaking ho. I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com. I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com. Oh, by the way, this is The Mandroid Show. Let's talk about Android news of the week. Yeah, it's The Android Show. It's pretty exciting! Ah! Drink some good old holiday drinks. <coughs> well, that's almost pure alcohol. Oh, those angry birds. It really makes me laugh. Shut up! Holy crap! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Got him! Whoa. That's awesome! <laughs> The 
very first hot nerdy girl of the week is the mantra hot nerdy girl of this week is it's time for a hot nerdy girl of the week. Hot, hot. The HTC1S. <sighs> I'll call I really didn't want you to find out like this. Anyways, guys, I am David, your Android junkie, over at AndroidSpin.com. Well, all right, guys, I am David, your Android junkie, over at AndroidSpin.com. And this has been the Mandroid Show. The Mandroid Show. Oh, I think I got a cramp. Mandroid Show. Mandroid Show. Hosted by a mofo. Okay, it's cold. Yeah, I definitely have something wrong with me. My mom says I don't. Well, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Again, I appreciate you guys watching. It's been fun. I love doing these videos, and hopefully I can do more of them. I'm actually uh, thinking about doing a whole other video segment, too, on this, on, on this channel, so we'll see what happens with that. I'll let you guys know. Well, all right, guys, I appreciate you clicking once again. Make sure you hit that like, thumbs up button, show love with a like, subscribe to the Android Spin channel. Check down the links below for my Twitter, G Plus page, all that fun stuff. Just watch my other channel. I haven't done a vlog in a while. I'll probably do one this weekend, so check it out. Well, all right, guys, I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been the Mandroid Show. Real Mandroid Show! Wow! Stop, stop, stop! Don't show my freaking disgusting man nipples again. Okay, show them again. Woo! <laughs> you know you loved it.